Prometera Biosciences is a biotechnology company bring forward new technologies, new products in the space of the liver diseases. Our mission is to develop uh, those innovative products based on stem cell technologies, progenitor stem cells, in order to bring effective solutions to unmet medical needs in liver disorders. Prometera is targeting uh, two main categories of disease, inflammatory and fibrotic liver diseases. And the second inborn error of liver metabolism, which means that you have a deficiency in one enzyme, one function of the liver cell. Prometera basically covers um, uh, different uh, uh, types of liver cells, which go from uh, uh, mesenchymal liver stem cells, EPA stem, hepatobiliary stem cell, we call H2 stem, as well as uh, differentiated cells that are heparesc. Heparesc was developed by uh, Cytonet and uh, Prometera has acquired the assets of Cytonet earlier this year. Heparesc is a normal liver cell. This product uh, contains all the enzymes of the liver cells, so you administer these cells in children with very severe uh, urea cycle disease to stabilize them, allow them to reach safely liver transplantation. Epastem is a liver-derived stem cell, so it is a progenitor cell uh, that we harvest from the liver, that we multiply in vitro, and then that we re-administer to these patients also to bring them new uh, enzyme activity. Epastem is more targeting children who are too sick to have a good quality of life and we want to improve the quality of life of these children to uh, go to school and to uh, reach adulthood without brain damage. Epastem is a multidrug. It means that uh, the same cell can uh, have multiple functions, uh, producing a lot of different enzymes, but also secreting proteins and also what we call cytokines. So Epastem can replace enzyme, and produce different active compounds uh, addressing many, many different acquired disease of the liver, such as fibrosis and inflammation. And one particular target that we are addressing now is acute and chronic liver failure. So we want to, to, to stop the process and to stop inflammation and to restore liver function. And a second wide indication is NASH, which is non-alcoholic steatohepatitis and we want also to control the fibrotic process in this disease. We showed in vitro and in vivo anti-fibrotic and anti-inflammatory properties. We have shown these uh, with immune cells in vitro as well as in non-alcoholic state hepatitis model in preclinical trials. So the next now is to test on uh, different types of diseases like primary sclerosing cholangitis, which unfortunately right now there are no treatments available, but also IBD, inflammatory bowel disorders, which is associated also with liver. H2 stem is our second generation product and is an hepatobiliary stem cell that is capable to strongly differentiate into hepatocytes. So we use our cells to repopulate, to transplant in preclinical trials and we show very high engraftment and in vivo differentiation. So now the key objective is to um, expand these cells in order to uh, reach a sufficient amount of cells for treating. Uh, patients with liver failure or patients who are missing uh, hepatic function. We aim at uh, bringing uh, H2 stem in clinical trial for both by artificial liver and also treatment of patients with liver failure. Our ambition was basically matched with a very strong robust execution by identifying our gaps and then running after our most advanced competitor which was Cytonet, a German company with a US subsidiary. And within this short time frame, Prometera transformed itself into a much bigger company using a very broad IP state, a very deep know-how, talented people joining us. Presence in the US in Durham, North Carolina was a GMP manufacturing facility with a huge network of uh, OPOs serving the purpose of our stem cell technologies uh, into the liver supply and liver sourcing to Prometera Biosciences LLC in the US. 
and then of course uh, our ma manufacturing capacities here in Belgium. We are committed to become the dominant player in the space of liver disorders using stem cells and cell therapies and we have put in place all the necessary tools to secure this robust execution and become the leader in the space.